What up, people? It's your boy, K-Mass. I'm back again with another reaction. But before we get into that, guys, I want to, uh, I want you guys to show some love to the Patreons and, uh, hit that, uh, button, you know, that one right here, hit that button and show me some love, hit that like button, you know, all that good, good stuff. Now, the reaction that we're going to do today, the reaction is, it's not paranormal, it's not a puzzle. I'm going back and I'm going to do a reaction to a new video. Now, a lot of you guys know I'm a fan of Hobson. I've listened to his music forever, ever since uh, I heard um, Kill Her, where he talks about Tamika Washington, uh, Easy E's wife, and how she screwed him on Ruthless Records. Well, we ain't going to do that reaction because I've already seen that video hundreds of times. But we're going to do one today. This is a new one called COVID Mansion. He just released, I guess he's been stuck in a house with somebody and just released a new video. So, guys, let's get into it. I'm going to I'm gonna have to move that sign right, that sign right there. I'm going to move it up because my tower is blocking it. Or, hold on. There we go. All right. Now you guys get to see the whole song. All right, guys, let's get into the video. Right now, I'm in Thailand, quarantine. Hold on, man. I just got to say, he, all right, he's in Thailand, evidently, from what he said. But this house is fucking amazing. And the video, uh, the pictures I've been seeing from his Instagram are awesome. Great intro. Let's let's get going. It's a foreign scene. Can't go to the airport and leave. And I thought my whole life was boring. Jeez, excuse me. I'm about to bang my forehead on the floor and scream. The dude I'm staying with's annoying. How much fucking torture can boredom be? Take my ass to the Morgan piece, Look, bitch. Dude that he's staying with's annoying. Hey, You've been around people that are annoying. How do you deal with them people? Me, I just kind to block out, maybe. It's 2020, I was preparing some new bombs and making sure that my competition go put a noose on. Ooh. My aggression ain't really a subtle nuance. I've been in the game 10 years, I cannot do wrong. Who's on one? I'm on a savage as usual. I'm back in the booth, I have rappers to prove on. Yeah. Now there just ain't many brands I can move on. All because someone ain't bad soup in Wuhan. Ooh, damn. Damn. Damn, he's killing it. Well, shit, that's what I heard. I don't know what it was mixed with, but for someone to jeopardize everyone's life, man, it must have been fucking delicious. For real. This shit is fucking ridiculous. Can't oh, that mask is dope. I like that. I'd have to paint it up, though. I've got one I gotta paint up like uh, Sub Zero. Yeah. Be with my son and my siblings, the government tripping. My pussy appointments with dozens of bitches are canceled. Now, guess what? I'm tugging my dick with what? my right hand. Oh, <laughs> when I get a tingle inside of my penis, I'm like, hi, my friend. Hi. Hey, you know the lotion is sitting on my nightstand. Hi. And when I finish my. He likes talking about spanking it a lot. Minutes I go to Night Night Land. And now I gotta take a weapon get in groceries. Hopefully, motherfuckers know the back away Cody feet. Don't be jokingly mingling if you happen to notice me. I ain't fucking with none of you niggas to the Rona League. Ugh, get back. Hey, move back. Step back. Y'all better not touch me. Hey, get Alright, Hobson took a break, man. He came back hard as hell. Back, come on, move back. Step back. Y'all better not touch me. Uh, I'd have been told y'all niggas back up. Move. You don't wanna see me call back up. No, so get back. Move back. Step back. Y'all better not touch me. We all at home. We camping out. I noticed everybody made a TikTok. Oh, we dancing now. And I see about four, five, six hundred new hoes made an OnlyFans account. Get your money, girl. Better get your dope. Yeah, blast them titties one time. This ain't funny, girl. You finna be broke. You don't want <laughs> Do look like a ninja running around and shit. Be a broke, bitch. Somebody told me it was the 5G towers and everybody. Let me go back. Uh, let me. All right. Back to his account. Get your money, girl. Better get your dope. Yeah, blast them titties one time. All right, so how many of you guys actually created TikTok? Me, personally, I haven't done it, and I'm not sure if I can uh, 
get into doing TikTok. I mean, because I've already I got too much. I never got into Snapchat, so it is what it is. Hey, funny girl, you finna be broke. You don't wanna be a broke bitch. Somebody told me it was the 5G towers, and everybody's immunity spiraling downward. And if it's true, fight the power. The time is now. I gotta divide the crowd from the mindless cowards. I know y'all love when I recite some foul words, especially during the COVID 19 outburst. And all right, he said it was the 5G towers. Uh, well, people are thinking that. What? I mean, I get that the radiation and all that coming off of them can create some medical issues, but as far as a respiratory system issue, can the towers, can they? Nah. People with mass hysteria media is bullshit. From the mindless cowards, I know y'all love when I recite some foul words, especially during the COVID 19 outburst. And I got nothing better to do, evidence proofs. I'll be spending hours live on IG Wowsers. Wait, hold up. Wait, that's strange. I sent a text. Why you ignoring, you ignoring me? me? Hmm. I know you got time to reply, but don't even lie, cause you in the quarantine. Huh. Yeah, I know how you do. You with your boo. You treating my feelings so morbidly after this song drop. Bitch, I'm blocking you. Don't be surprised when you text it, it's going green. <laughs> We deal with a worldwide corruption. I don't know if the media is hyping up shit. Look at the situation our life is stuck in. I got no toilet paper to wipe my butt with. Whoever Dude, you got enough toilet paper to wipe your butt with. Is hyping up shit. Look at the situation our life is stuck in. I got no toilet paper to wipe my butt with. Whoever did this is on hops and shit. This God forbid the world gets apocalyptic. Will it end soon? Look at all the odds against it. Speaking of that, so they say they got the guy who created the virus. How long? How long do you think he'll survive? Or will he be working for the government? Why isn't he trying to create a fucking... Uh, why are they making him create a damn uh, antivirus or whatever the fuck it is? A cure for this shit. This is on hops and shit. This guy forbid the world gets apocalyptic. Will it end soon? Look at all the odds against it. So don't touch me without my permission. Uh, get back. Hey. Move back. Step back. Y'all better not touch me. Hey, get back. Come on. Move back. Step back. Y'all better not touch me. Uh, I'd have been told y'all niggas back. Move. You don't want to see me. Hey, if, if you're going to be stuck in a house, this fucking house he's stuck in. Oh, hell, I'd be good with that, man. Stick me in a house. Put me under quarantine or something like that. I mean, look at that pool right there overlooking. Oh, look at the view he's got, man. Like, why would being stuck in that house? I mean, yeah, you'd go crazy after a while, but that house is dope. Call back up. No, so get back. Move back. Step back. Y'all better not touch me. All right, guys. So, anyways, this video was dope. Hobson came back with a dope ass video. I didn't expect him to do one. And I know I'm late on doing a reaction to this, but you know, it is what it is. Now, the thing I want to talk about the uh, COVID. What do you guys do? Do you go out? Do you wear a mask out when you go to the stores? Do you wear gloves in the stores? Which, that's actually a, technically a bad thing. Wearing the gloves. Because, I mean,. People don't know how to use gloves. They don't know how to use the PPE correctly. So you go in, you put your gloves on while you're driving your car. You get out of your car. You go into the store. You pick up a box that maybe somebody that was sick that had COVID, which I do know somebody that actually tested positive for it. So, yes, I do know one person that I know of. Anyways, that I know personally. Uh, and they're doing good. Now, you touch this product that somebody else has touched. That actually had the disease that while they were wearing their gloves or their sneeze into their hands and get their hands all over their stuff, you know, and they grabbed the cereal box that your kids are going to be picking up. You just touch that same cereal box with your gloves. You go out, you touch a few more things, you touch this, you touch that, you touch something you don't want, and then you put it back. You're spreading whatever that damn person sneezed on their hands and touched that box. You're spreading that around. And I know this pandemic is crazy, but the best offense that I found, I don't, I'm, I'm not sick. I started out with a uh, flu, to be honest, before all this started, or right when all this started, I had a flu, which is the first time I've been sick in years. At least I probably had it before, just never really realized it because I can fight through it. I don't care. It doesn't scare me. Uh, but going 
out wearing gloves. These people I've seen, people wearing the gloves, and while they're wearing them, touching everything, they're grabbing at their face masks, they're wiping their face, they're picking cigarettes up, smoking a cigarette with the glove on, and the little butt going into the mouth. But it it's not helping none. Don't just don't wear gloves. Wash your hands. Go into the store. Stop in the bathroom. Wash your hands before you go. Put some uh, sanitizer on. Uh, but you have to leave the hand sanitizer on your hands for five minutes wet. Don't rub it all in. Let it sit there for five minutes because that's how it's going to work. It's not going to work if you rub it in. You're rubbing it all, drying it out. So it's not going to work. But anyways, guys, stay safe. Keep your, keep your health up, and if you enjoy doing me doing a music reaction, let me know if you want to see more music reactions. I started this out doing reaction to music, and then I went to doing the paranormal stuff. But, yeah, I, I love seeing videos, and sometimes it's hard because I'll see these videos while I'm out, and I'll start watching them, and like I did with this one, I started to watch this one. I was like, oh, wait a minute, I'm going to do a reaction to it. But, guys, thank you for watching. Hit that like, subscribe, share this video. Tell your mommy, your cousin, sister, aunt, bra baby brothers, fiance, nephew, anybody. Uh, I don't care if it's the dog. Make the dog sit down and watch the motherfucking video on their own account. All right, guys. I'm out.